Hi everybody, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com with Jaspie's 10 box out of the park baseball mixer, random team break number three. Featuring some really nice boxes here, ladies and gentlemen. You can see the picture right there as well. Big thanks to this group for making it happen. So thanks to the people who bought their spots straight up and congrats to the people who won spots in that filler, the optic choice break number three. All 30 baseball teams are in. And let's roll it and randomize it one and a four, five times each. One, two, three, four, and five. We got Jason all the way down to Brett. Hey, Joe Pizzle. Hey, Joe Pizzle. Let's go, Suns, he says. Got a bet in Booker, 29 and a half plus points and a Suns win. What were the odds on that? One and a four, five times for the teams. One, two, three, four, and five. I hope all those, I hope the rest of the Nuggets Suns game, I hope that goes seven games and all OTs, multiple OTs. Got Dodgers down to White Sox after five. All right. Copy the wrong names here. That's after five times. That's Dodgers down to White Sox. There we go. Yeah, for a for a two way parlay, that's not horrible. Plus three twenty five. Maybe you want like, but yeah, that's that's safe though. That's safe. Jason with the Dodgers. Scott with the Reds. Mickey with the Red Sox. Zach with the Nationals. Chris with the Angels. Tristan with the O's. Chris with the Rockies, Tristan with the Mets, Eddie with the Rangers, Barry with the Cubs, Scott with the Pirates, Brandon with the Guardians, Tristan with the Cardinals, Brandon with the Braves, Zach with the Padres, Victor with the Tigers, Jason with the Rays, Scott with the Yankees, Jason with the Royals, Matt with the Brew Crew, Jason Parker, Last Bot Mojo, Minnesota Twins, David with the Phillies, Zach with the Blue Jays, Boyd with the A's, Tristan with the Astros, Devin with the Marlins, David with the Giants, Chris with the Diamondbacks, Jordan with the Mariners, and Brett with the Chicago White Sox. So let's sort by team. And we're gonna pause the video. When we come back, we're gonna see if there's any trades and then we will have the break. Stick around, we'll see you on the other side. All right, welcome back everybody. Look at that. There's some, some deals being done here. Here's the first deal, Rockies for Royals. Rockies for Royals. So Jason is into the Rockies spot. Put a T there for trade. Chris is now in the Royal spot. Put T there for trade. And then Jason, wheeling and dealing, made another deal. Is out of the twin spot and into the red spot. Put a lowercase T there for trade. And then Scott is out of the red spot and into the twin spot. I hope you've been studying your checklist. I don't know if these are, these are good deals or not. But trade windows closed. LBC for real, what's going on? Good evening. LBC's in the uh, Twitter, Twitter, Twitch stream. You can see all this, both streams, and the uh, chat right there above my head. Got a little NBA action on in the background. We've got a. Uh, Suns at Nuggets on in the background. Game just started, 11-7, Denver. All right, big thanks to everybody here for making this happen, appreciate it. Like I said, we found uh, we found the exact same boxes so we can run this mixer back. I loaded up another version of this mixer. This has been doing well, it's been fun. All right, so we're gonna start with the base heavier stuff first on the left side and then we'll go with the quicker stuff on the right side over there, and then we'll end with this baseball, and we'll do uh, we'll do who am I? If there is, you know, we should have mentioned this earlier. I forgot about this. If there is a multi, if there is a multi-signed baseball, well, we'll cross that bridge when it gets there. Usually, we'll be able to look up the baseball and see as many names as possible. So whatever names we see, 
We'll use that for a randomizer. Generally, the multi-signed baseball should be just one team, but sometimes they could be two different teams. And we'll cross that bridge when we get there. It'll be a good problem to have. It'll just be a randomizer. All right, let's start with 2020 Bowman Draft Super Jumbo. Five autographs in here. Oh, Jason, don't encourage him. Then you might, then Rex might start thinking he's funny. Then he starts trying more jokes, inevitably, because he can't just leave it with just one. And then the next one won't be as good. And then we'll just then it'll just be like it'll just be like cringe city at that point. It's yeah, even Rex knows it. He can't help himself though. And he'll he'll try to force it he'll he'll try to force another joke. And then we'll be like, Rex, why didn't you quit when you were ahead? Got greedy. Got greedy with the last. So this is 2020. I mean, we some of these players, some of these guys in here, I forget who was in that 2020 draft class, but we should start seeing some of the some of the prospects in here. Probably start seeing them in some major league games here. You thought the multi signs have one of the Tigers? Oof. You thought wrong, Victor. You thought wrong, unfortunately. Got to read the item descriptions, ladies and gentlemen. All right. Is Jordan Walker in this one? Best baseball movie, Jason's asking. I'm partial to... Uh, I'm partial to... A League of Their Own and Feel the Dreams. There's Tristan Casas, 8 out of 250. I think he's up with the Red Sox now. Goes to Mickey. All right, we got Bobby Miller. I think he's a big prospect for my Dodgers. Jason K, he might he might see some starts at some point this year. Maybe be towards the top of that rotation. There's just regular Julio Rodriguez. I think he was in he's in a different set. Where his, he must have been in Bowman. That's where his first must have been. Adley Rushman, and we've got P.D. Halpin. 53 out of 150, blue wave autograph for the Guardians. Brandon with Cleveland. Cleveland, this is for you. That's Bowman first, Adley Rushman. Yours is Field of Dreams? I've, have you been to the Field of Dreams? I went to the Field of Dreams a few years ago. We got Austin Hendrick to 499. Jason with the Reds. Jason Parker with the Rockies gets the Zach Veen and the Heston Kirkstad goes to Tristan and the Orioles. Victor likes Major League. No, he meant Major just Major League. Major League's pretty good. 
too high. Too high. Who the F cares? It's gone. Who is this effing guy? <laughs> this guy's dead. Cross him off then. <laughs> That's not a Volpe first, but all card ship. Gilbert first? No. Riley Green first? No. All card ship, right? Yeah, all card ship. And to Spencer Torkelson first. He's been heating up a little bit, ladies and gentlemen. I've got him on my fantasy team. I've been keeping track. Victor with the Tigers. Michael Bush. Not, it's not his first, but he's been called up recently, playing some games. Hey, bartender, Joe Boo needs a refill. Are you, you saying Jesus Christ can't hit a curveball? Jesus, don't start a holy war. Uh, Trent Palmer, 42 out of 99. That's going to go to the Blue Jays. That'll be for Zach and Bradley Beasley. Autograph for the Cubs. That's going to be for Barry and the Cubbies. Uh, O'Neill Cruz, no, just not his first. Yeah, Bobby Wood Jr. was in the previous one. Ed Howard. Robert Hassel, these guys are good. Robert Hassel, Padres edition, that's going to go to Zach. Is Ed Howard going to be anybody? Rex? Rex, give me an Ed Howard update. Barry with the Cubs. There's Nick Bitsko to 150 for the Rays, Jason Parker. I forgot how many cards there were in the Super Jumbo. Pick up the pace on this break a little bit here. Uh, Brandon Fat made us made a start today. How did he do? If he did well, I'll sleeve it. Homegrown but injury prone. Homegrown but injury prone. No prone zone. Injury prone zone. Diamondbacks. Hmm. No, not a good start for uh, for Fat. Three innings, four earned runs already. All right, I, I won't sleep him, but I'll still go to you, Chris. There's Jordan Walker's first. Sort of was having a decent run with the Cardinals, but was sent back down to the minor for some reason. That's going to go to Tristan in St. Louis. And there's Austin Hendrick and a Bryce Elder. 44 out of 250. Bowman first purple chrome autograph for Brandon and the ATL. There's Austin Hendrick right there. Ah, oh, Victor. That's some uh that's some JV trivia here. You gotta hiss with that that varsity trivia. Pedro Serrano, same guy from the, not the Geico commercials, but the uh, Allstate commercials. That's like telling us that, uh, it's like telling us that, uh, that Antonio Gates used to play basketball. Or that Kershaw and Matthew Stafford were best friends growing up.
Hats for bats. Keep bats warm. Gracias. Right. Did they? There's Tristan Casas. But did Bryce Harper and Chris Bryant actually play together? There's Speckled Tristan Casas and a Owen Cassie autograph for the Padres. Zach Gwynn. I think they played against each other. I think Bryce Harper and Joey Gallo grew up playing together on like the same like all-star team or something like that. Chess <laughs> is just run by lizard people. Yes, that that now that's some varsity level trivia right there. We got a Patrick Bailey paper to four ninety Had the lyrics for those. Which really have the lyrics to the BK commercials run across the screen with a little bouncy ball on it so we can all sing along. Uh, Spencer Torkelson is one. Robert Hassel, Bowman First are in here. Here's uh, Alaric Soler to four ninety nine. That's going to be for the Twins. Scott drawing first blood in that trade. Jordan Walker's Bowman first are in here. Gabe, et cetera, et cetera. All right, super jumbo. Now we'll go to Jumbo. And we flash forward a year to 2021. Oh, that was 2020, Gabe. You're talking about 2021? Kirkside, maybe Casey Myers, maybe? I don't know. We'll find out. Both grew up in Las Vegas area where they played on the same travel team called the Ball Busters. Harper and Brian, huh? What about Joey Gallo, Rex, while you're doing that research? Maybe it was Joey Gallo they played against. I mean, that's according to Rex, although Rex does require frequent fact checking. All the parents are okay with ball busters, I guess. I don't know what what age they were in that travel team, but I 
right, speaking of Joey Gallo, there he is. Right, and Henderson. There's Antonio Gomez, Bowman first autograph for the Yankees. That's going to go to Scott Goodman. We've got a Scott E and a Scott G. Nick Gonzalez, purple chrome to 250 for the Pirates, Scott E. This paper will ship, but we want to try to find the top guys here in their uh, in their chrome style here. But all cards ship. Oh, man, Denver's up 35-20. The first quarter winding down. Jose Salas. And there's Leody Tavares, 48 out of 150. Blue chrome autograph, little color match there for Eddie Harden and the Rangers. Austin Martin was one of the big names from 2021, right? If I remember correctly, I think he got traded to, it still goes to the Blue Jays, but he was traded. Zach Gwynn with that one. We got Shane Bieber. Um, Sky Blue, paper to 499. That'll be for Cleveland. That's going to be for Brandon. Brett Beatty refractor to 499. That's for Tristan and the Mets. He's been playing these days, right? And Logan Gilbert's been playing. Bryce Turing. Positional promise. Oh, I thought that was a thicker card for a second. No, that's just the other card that was attached back there. And Stevie Emanuels, Bowman first autograph for the A's. That's going to be for Boyd in the Oakland A's. The A's, I think, finalized the land purchase in Las Vegas. I'm not quite, I, I got to do some research on this, but I'm not quite sure exactly where the location is. One location made it seem like it was near the Orleans. There's an empty lot there. There's Luis Garcia to 299, that is, Phillies. But then they said it was closer to the Tropicana, which is on the other side of the freeway in Las Vegas, so I don't know what's going on. I don't know exactly where it is, but I'll re be revealed soon. All right. 
know, one more Bowman to do, then we'll then we'll get to some of that one pack, one card per box stuff. Here's 2022 Bowman Baseball Hobby Edition. And we got some Bowman Baseball in the store, folks. Jumbo Edition, eight box jumbo. Get into it. I think, it's, I think we're just down to a filler to unlock another case. It'll, Rex is thinking it'll probably be in one of the most unsafe areas. I'm not sure they would do that. I think the locations I mentioned are actually in the safer areas of town. Wow, plot twist, they purchased land for parking, we'll share the same with the Raiders again. That would be kind of hilarious. But I don't, I'm trying to think. I don't think there's a, I guess you could squeeze it. The dimensions would be weird, because you can't, they can't move, I don't think they can move seats around in the Raiders stadium, so. I guess you could, you could squeeze the home plate into one corner of the end zone. Yeah Vegas, yeah, Vegas will now have a minor league team and a pro team now. I guess it won't be that difficult to shuttle guys from AAA to... Because I think it's the, it's the A's AAA team too, right? I feel like there's one other team that... One or two other teams that have their AAA affiliate in the, almost in the same city. I think the mini, mini Minnesota Twins, I think they have their AAA team in St. Paul. I think they're one of them, or is that, maybe I'm thinking of something else. There's uh, Michael Triana to 299, speckle for the Reds, Jason. And there's Rubio and Angeles for the Padres. That's gonna go to Zach. Rex is laughing at the fact that Cardinals are playing their worst season in 50 years. Well, not their worst season in 50 years. They're their worst start to a season in 50 years. A small but important distinction. But they pull Contreras from catching. They come to play the Cubs and win two in a row. Hey, maybe, maybe, the, uh, maybe the Cardinals did your Cubs a favor, Rex. They took Wilson Contreras off your hands. Vegas 51s is a good is a good name, but a good name for a minor league team. There's a Wander Franco rookie card. And that'll be for the Rays, that'll be for Jason Parker. Yeah, well, that's why we play the 162, Rex. That's why we play the 162. Should be Las Vegas Aces. The uh, WNBA team has rights to that name. There's Max Muncy to 399. 
purple paper. Different Max Muncy. This goes to Boyd and the A's. There's Hassan Kim. Green paper to 99. And I think Mark Davis of the Raiders owns the Vegas Aces, the WNBA team. Won a title recently. And um, I don't think he's on very good terms with the Oakland A's ownership. So I don't think he's going to be sharing that name or giving up that name anytime soon. All right, onwards. So we're done with the base heavy stuff. Let's see what we got here. Archives. This is active player edition. And we got Dylan Cease. Four out of 39. That's Cubs edition of Dylan Cease. That's right. Forgot about that. And that will be for Barry and Chicago. This is my kind of town, Chicago is. All right, next is Royce Lewis. For the twins, Scott. Scott E with that one. The uh, former number one overall pick. get into some 2020 tier one baseball. There's this blank card here. The relic is Yu Chang, 273 out of 395, rookie relic for the Guardians, Brandon. We got Boba Shett, rookie auto. Nice. 129 out of 299. Yeah, this is the kind of stuff we're looking for. Toronto, Zach Gwynn with the Blue Jays. Nice. He's having a solid season thus far. And we got Corey Dickerson, 22 out of 299. That's for the Phillies, David Thorpe. Ah, the X Line's here. Worst season indeed, Rex. Josh X Line is saying, but they still winning that division. just breaking things all right we'll flash forward a year from 2020 to 2021 tier one baseball well, we got the man of steel ricky henderson 19 out of 25 dual relic for boyd and the a's Game used material. And we got Gary Sanchez, 179 out of 399. Piece of his jersey going to Scott G and the Yankees. I think he just got picked up by uh, somebody. Everyone's breaking something, Gilo. There's Yohan Mankata, 126 out of 300. For the White Sox, that's for Brett. Ah, by the Mets. Gary Sanchez picked up by the Mets. This one goes to Brett and the White Sox once again. And then 
We've got Andres Jimenez, speaking of that, 67 out of 300 rookie autograph for Tristan in the Metropolitans. All right, next. Rex is wondering, do you think Cardinals can really come back from eight games behind? Come on, Rex. We're only 20, like, 20, what are we, 30 games into the season? Have we even played 25% of the season? It's a lot of time. I mean, teams can be behind eight games in the division with, like, a month and a half to go and still be able to, to come back, chase a team down. All right, hit parade. First one is Freddie Freeman, Golden Graphs, 18 out of 20. Braves edition going to Brandon. About how many teams are able to make that big of a not too many teams, you're right. But if there is a team that could, it's the St. Louis Cardinals. I mean, Nolan Arenado, Paul Goldschmidt, that pitching staff, you know, they, they're constructed to play a lot better than they're playing now. I mean, if it's like the A's, yeah, they're season some. <laughs> Right, yeah, I don't exactly, Scott. I don't think we're even 25% of the way through the season. All right. Next one is sticking with tier one, Chris Bryant. 62 out of 65 on card autograph. It's from 2019 tier one baseball. So we had a box of 2020 tier one baseball, 2021 tier one baseball, and we pulled a 2019 tier one baseball. All right, now let's see what's in. Let's see what the baseball is gonna be. All right, I'll just tear that tear that open there. All right, it's not a multi-auto, and this is a uh, this is a pretty good player. Who? Uh, let's put your thinking cats on. We're gonna play. Who am I? Uh, who am I? Twenty-five year old outfielder, DH, a righty. I have a uh, I have a career two eighty two batting average, one hundred twenty six home runs, three hundred sixteen runs batted in, and one hundred twenty two hundred and twenty two stolen bases. Played for one team my entire career, a three-time All-Star, an NL Rookie of the Year, a two-time Silver Slugger, an NL Stolen Base Leader, and already in my young career, part of the 30-30 club. He might go 40-40 this year. Uh, Barry. Got, Barry has the Cubs. He got that Chris Bryant autograph. Hey, Josh, how's it going, man? Good to see you. Any guesses? No, one's had, no one has any guesses? That's for, there you go. Jason Parker, Ronald Acuna Jr. That's for Brandon and the Braves. There's the hologram sticker. There's his autograph. And there's the Fanatics authentication sticker as well. There you go, gang. That was a fun break. That was Jaspie's 10 box out of the park baseball mixer, random team number three.
we got another version of this exact same boxes in the store now, plus a couple fillers. So let's get that going. Jaspiescasebreaks.com. I'm Joe. I'll see you next time for the next baseball break. Bye-bye.